So much love and appreciation to those of you who have been with me for the two year period plus that I've been doing this. Um, thank you for showing your uh, love and support to the channel and to anybody else who is brand new to the platform and you would like to support the channel. Also, you can do it by way of Patreon, Anchor, the clothing store, and also the shoe shop that is listed in the comment description below. And again, thank you to any and all of you guys who have been here to support this channel during the two plus year period. I wouldn't be able to do what I do every single day without you. An Oklahoma festival worker is facing charges after authorities allege that he put a controlled substance in a customer's order. According to a statement from police, a customer called authorities on June 20th after finding an unexpected item in their food. Quote, an individual made an order at the restaurant when they received their order. They found a small baggie of narcotics inside of their bag. Officers learned that the baggie had a controlled substance or a crystalline substance inside of it that later field tested positive for methamphetamines. Officers arrived at the scene and spoke with the employees. After their interviews, they arrested Bryce Francis, an employee at the restaurant. He has been charged with distribution of a controlled substance within 2,000 feet of a school, as well as possession of a controlled substance. This is why it's very important for people to, in a sense, cook at home. Um, sure, you know, going out every once in a while, you know, to sit up there and get some food just because it's completely fine and dandy. But these are the risks, right, that we take whenever we decide that we want to go to a restaurant and order food, right? Somebody can happen to do something to your food. Somebody can put something in your food. Your order can end up being wrong. They can end up giving you the completely wrong order, or you might not even get a order at all. You know, it's, it's a variety of things that I can state that has taken place to a lot of people whenever they decided that they wanted to go out and patronize somebody else's business but this within itself is very much dangerous uh due to the fact not only could they have potentially have been stopped let's say by police uh during a random traffic stop or whatnot or whatever and this was basically there and then they would have to try to figure out a way to explain this you know in in such a way that it would be believable but that little bag of food could have been something for a child like maybe let's say for example it could have been like a kid's meal and we all know as you know once being children whenever you know our parents you know got the the food you know they pretty much just like looked real quick was like all right you got like nuggets apple slices whatever it is all right bag directly in the back right so what if you know very quickly you know the the parent in a rush didn't really check the bag they just automatically assumed everything was there and then within that bag was the said controlled substance right we all know how a lot of kids don't know right from wrong they don't know any type of hidden dangers they don't know any type of potentialities of you know what may occur if they see something strange there and they decide to ingest it so you know there could have been a variety of things that could have you know ended up going wrong luckily it didn't right by way of this fast food worker who is obviously a dealer right he's obviously working there for uh, a portion of a time he looks like if you look at the picture it looks like he has a habit right it looks like he both he basically deals and he sells um the exact same product right and more than likely he was waiting for somebody to you know come up there and get both orders and you know drive off but that's not what took place here so you know like i said uh people you got to be very careful and uh, you got to make sure to keep an eye out whenever you happen to get your orders because you might just so happen to get more than what you expected